Hello everybody, this is Falaran, and welcome back to Crater City. Hey, it's a regular Crater City ep episode, not a special, not a something else, it's just regular Crater City, which is awesome. I am here with my, uh, my guy, my, uh, purple tie guy. Why, why am I wearing the cape again? I thought I had that turned off. Oh, is it, it it's probably only turned off for, for multiplayer. Yep, show it again. Very good. Okay, um... I want to show you guys something. I have a cross in my face. There we go. I want to show you guys something um, that I have hinted at in some of the last videos when I did the recording. And that thing is the Prancing Tony Tavern and, and Disco. So let's go take a look at that. There's my cross again. Okay. Um, as you remember... Uh, wait, here. This over here is a De Prancing Tony Tavern and Den. Now let me let me give you a better look at it. It has a large tree in front of it. For a while now, I've I've decided that it needed to have. Oh, there's other stuff. I'm not going to show that because I have no idea whether I can or not. So that is the Tavern and Inns, right? Uh, not Inn. Sorry, Tavern and Disco. That is the Inn that Miguel built, and the tavern is right next to it because that way people who come to Crater City from out of town can sleep in the inn and go to eat at the tavern and dance the night away at the disco. So let's go in the front. The Prancing Tony Tavern and Disco. This down here is the eating area. As you can see there is uh, there's a lot of seating space you know for all the Craterians. There is a area where we uh, can or the owners can sell stuff, which I guess is me or everybody. No, it belongs to everybody. Whoever is in the mood for serving stuff can serve. There's two big fridges for stuff. There's a an oven to heat some. Uh, oh look, Calvados, very cool. Need to put this on the menu. Um, we have drinks, very fine drinks. Uh, wait, how do I do this now? Crap. Let's put that there. Water bottle. We are selling water. Uh, we're selling meat made by Graloth. Milk made by the cows outside. And Calvados. That is, Calvados is not on the menu as you can see because the Calvados is just for special guests. Only they get that. Then we have our bowls right here. And we have some food that we sell. Um, that's basically that. This is the exit for uh, employees only. This here is Crater City's seedy back alleyway. It's not so seedy yet. It needs another building right here, but maybe some time in the future someone's going to build... Are you kidding me with these chickens here? Maybe some time in the future someone's going to build something on there and uh, we'll move these horses and stuff out of the city center. We'll see. How that turns out. So let's get back inside because you guys haven't seen the uh, the really interesting stuff here. The upstairs. We have a disco upstairs. Look at this disco. Yeah. And on the contrary to the bottle in my hand, you don't really need to be drunk to have fun in the disco. So you can dance. Obviously, just dancing like this is uh, not fun. So you put up this and you dance around we actually did some dancing after a funeral we had to attend on Crater City the other day which uh, I think Dan the Let's Play Man will show you and uh, yeah so this is how we dance in Crater City <laughs> of course if uh, someone feels like it there's also another type of dancing right here huh? Mm -hmm. Uh, but sometimes, you know, this is the sound you want to dance to. Sometimes you want this rather peaceful stuff, but sometimes you just need the beat. And give me a sec, I need to prepare this. Lag incoming. Oh, shit. <laughs> Lag incoming. All right, let's turn on the beat. There we go. That is the <laughs> that is the beat machine. <laughs> oh, 
for the really hardcore <laughs> hardcore dancing sessions here. That was built by Dan. Uh, he um, he helped me out with delivering this order. Um, let's lag out going. There we go. That's that. Uh, there we go. Here, here's the upstairs. This is our beat machine right here. It's amazing. It works fantastically. Oh, damn tree. Grew into the house. Let's put that away. There. No one will know. This roof up here, by the way. Oh. The roof. Uh, I, I built the roof. And I wasn't a big fan of it. And then... Wait, let's go back. Let's go back. Ba ba ba. This is basically the Lagatron 2000 built by Dan the Man. It uh, does some fantastic noise making. Let me turn it on again so you guys. I'm not going to say anything about the lag this time. <laughs> Let's see if people notice. <laughs> this is how it works. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Woo. Look at that. That's just amazing. Oh. Gives me a headache though. <laughs> Let's turn it off. So the Lagatron 2000 is in the in the uh, in the roof of this this place, and it's uh, it's a lot of fun to dance with that on. Um, I think CQ actually gets a bit of lag. Oh, look at that! There's a police officer complaining about the noise. Noise complaint. The usual deal. <laughs> so that is Dan. Dan and uh, people apparently are having trouble. Oh, holy crap. <laughs> I'm a little dizzy. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, the roof. I, I was going to talk about the roof, but wait, you can't see the roof from my house anymore, so I'm going to need to find another place. Um, over here, I think you can actually see the roof, because I'm, uh, I'm quite happy with that roof. Dan, I built the roof that looked like a ugly hat sitting on this, um, sitting on this tavern. And, uh... So I asked Dan after the funeral, I asked him whether he would be willing to help me build another roof. And it turned out nicely, I think. It's actually spawn-proof, so that nothing can spawn up there. It's very cool. And, um, yeah, we did build that and had a lot of fun while doing it. We did that. We didn't film that uh, because we were talking Swiss German at each other. <laughs> We sometimes do that. It's a lot easier to, uh, you know, get things done when you can actually speak the language a bit better than we do. Well, we speak English fairly well, I guess, but it's still easier in the mother tongue. So, yeah, that is the tavern. What else is new? We have all kinds of crap going on over there. Well, not crap, good crap, good type of crap, you know, the... Ah, I'm not even going to talk about crap anymore. So, uh, good stuff going on over there. Good stuff going on over there. But the people who are building that stuff are most likely wanting to show that to yourself, uh, to you themselves. Then, can we film your house? We, we, um, me and the viewers. <laughs> All right, let's film Dan's house. This is the house of a Dan, uh, also known as the wait. Where's the rubber boots here? I need to put on rubber boots for this. Also known as the place that uh, you know what? Give me a sec. Just got 
not something on the floor. Let's pick up Skype. <laughs> All right. Hey, there he is. Hello, fella Ron. I'm sorry. I, did, I haven't muted. <laughs> That's no problem. Um, you want to show us your house? Sure. Let's do it. Well, he, here's chickens. Chickens, cool. I don't know who who that was. I'm guessing balance. He he chickens everybody. <laughs> yeah. Quarter City Poke Club. Holy crap! Why didn't I know about this? Well, because <laughs> I didn't know about it either. See. Oh, this is not yours. This is not mine. My tables are red. In this house, we have red tables. Uh huh. I Mi see. Miguel, he keeps saying, "It's a poker table. Make it green." <laughs> And nope. your balcony with a good view of yes the, Somebody. the tavern. Oh God! Oh rain! It does. Me, uh, you put up there. Do this. Oh, I see you. You brought your your uh, shoes. I brought my shoes. Yeah, because this is because of the roof. Dan's roof is a bit leaky. It's the land of perpetual moisture. Because I probably have to explain this. Um, Maybe. Vexy had some trouble getting around Dan's in-game name, Moisonator. So she kept calling him what? Moistertron? Moistertron. Moistertron. Which is my late horse's name as well. Uh, can I kill this chicken? Oops. Yeah, I was trying to take my house apart. Are you on creative? Yeah, you're on creative, aren't you? Yes, because <laughs> yeah, I can do that. Yeah, because we can totally do that. <laughs> All right. Uh, what else? Uh, I'll kill these chickens as well with my well, looting sword. Yes, that's a good idea, actually. What else? You well, got? you see this Vexy approved and CQ rocks. Oh, he CQ changed rocks. that. Holy crap! That hurt. Did I hit you? I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> that this hurt. used to say CQ approved as well, and then I think Darter changed it to CQ smells. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I think CQ changed it again. Which le leads me to believe that she checked my house. She wasn't ah, here. It's possible. Well, we have this lever here. Max Ooh. Mm -hmm. And there's my basement. Yeah, it's the same stuff like in your entrance. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I, I forgot <laughs> my... If you're going to hit me with your sword, I better <laughs> wear some armor here. Oh, by well, the way, I, uh, yes. I drank a water bottle. I'm going to give you the bottle oh, for, for recycling later. Okay. Well, this is my farms. Very nice. By the way, I farmed these for you. <laughs> and at that point, you didn't have the chest yet. And I was standing here for like a minute trying to figure out where the hell the stuff was going. <laughs> until I realized that, of course, it was in the hoppers. <laughs> so, yes, this, these, these levers are how to farm. Those are very nice. I like this, uh, this slab look here. Yeah, I know. <gasps> There's coal. Should I grab it? Uh, yeah, knock yourself out. I can grab the fortune pick. So... So, by the way, a gimmick of this cactus farm is that you lose most of it, and you can't even get to those in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> That's an awesome cactus farm, then. <laughs> I know, thanks. I see, it's totally your, your type of build. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh you're yeah. going to need some stone up here, man. Watch out, you're gonna fall into Charlie's basement. Oh, really? Yep. So very close? Very. Alright, I'll leave the hole for you. It's uh, it's it's spawn ready. That's so. not... <laughs> <laughs> well, it's mob farm as well now. No, yeah. if you if you got some stone for me, then... Uh... I'll fake her up real quick. You go ahead and film more of your episode. Alright, I'll continue filming more of my episode, and I'll talk to you later. Alright, bye-bye. Bye. All right, guys. Uh, that was Dan the Man. By the way, if uh, if you haven't heard channel update, Dan and I we've started playing Uncharted Territory three together. It's fun, so watch it. Yeah. All right. Uh, I think this episode is long enough. We are gonna end it where we end most of our episodes, if I'm not mistaken, on top of Sterling Tower. I'm gonna have to build one in the new place next time. Um, Next time, maybe next time we'll talk about the new project. There's the roof again. Look at it. It's beautiful. Gigantic, but beautiful. That's what she said. Uh, <laughs> next time, 
or maybe the time after that we're gonna talk about the new project but for now this is it thanks for watching talk to you later bye bye